there's something you can't find using a search engine. Yourself. On the other hand, we know everything about our leaders, our celebrities, and still we know nothing about ourselves. We think we do. You can name your favorite colors, songs, sports, teams, places to go, because the things you love or hate are the ones that make yourself really you. But who decided on them? Was that really you? Or did your mother tell you that some colors are for girls and others for boys? Did your peers tell you that some songs are cool and others aren't? Did your friends decide what sport will be the most popular? And did your father tell you what the best sports team is? Haven't we all loved something just because others do? Or hated just to be part of the group? Let's admit it. Whatever we do, our actions are always influenced. And we have lost track of our influences. To the point where we think we came up with it all. We don't live our lives. We live the lives we're told to. Just because it's good for us. Shouldn't we know what's best for us? And if our decisions aren't really ours, who are we then? Who are you? Is your life the best possible? How could it be? If you don't know if it's meant for you, the question now is, how do you find yourself? Your true and free self? There's a secret, a catch to it. And it's as simple as it is brilliant. Are you ready for it? In order to know yourself, you need to stop thinking. Stop thinking about what your close ones told you, what society told you, what your culture told you. Stop thinking about dogmas. Stop thinking about what you've been taught. Start all over with the one thing you need to know, yourself. Easier said than done, isn't it? But you don't need to live in a cave to find out who you are. You don't need any of the outdated morals you already know. You need an entirely new philosophy. Juvenism. Your inner power. It means I am capable. I am a creator. And you really are. You're capable of everything. As long as you discover yourself. And to do that, you need freedom. A place where you answer to no one's expectations. Because everyone there expects complete freedom. A place where no one knows your socially accepted image. Where no one judges you. A place to discover what you really love, hate, care for, fear, need, desire. A place to discover yourself. The story of your freedom begins with... Duvamis.